Biggie is a real friend to me. I cried the day Biggie died. And I was in LA. I was but I was sitting behind Biggie. C's was right here in the car. And D was right there in, in, the, in Biggie's truck. And Biggie was like, yo, Murray, I got shows in London. Do you think I should stay here or leave? I said, Big, you know they do not like you out here. Leave. Me, Eric Sermon, and Redman did not go to the Soul Train Award party or the Vince. Eric knocked on my door and said, yo, they killed your man. I said, who? Biggie. I used to come from uptown. Before I was with Eric Sermon, I used to sell drugs. My step pops Les used to uh, show me how to go cook it up in the stove. Then I learned how to cook it in the microwave. I used to come from school uptown and before going to see Eric, I would go see Biggie Smalls and pop out on him. And he'd be like, yo, I feel blessed because this is the time we was... 20, 21, 19, high school, doing jail, and, you know, living the life of Raleigh. So we was all figuring out what we was doing with our lives. So we was all coming up. And Biggie was like, yo, should I leave or stay here? I said, leave. Why would you be around here? And people in L.A., they walk up and shoot you. They pop you. They pop. They shoot. This shit is real. You know what I'm saying? It's real. It was real that time. So, it was like, yo, they killed your man. And then, we was in the hotel. And I ain't going to say his name, but they was like, yo, we know who did it. We know who killed Big. At that time, I was... I was like, I said, word, okay, I ain't going to say who was in the room, but I know C's was there. I said, okay, let's go get the guns and let's go kill somebody because they killed Big. Let's go kill somebody and get out of here. See, I'm like, like, it's very edgy. That's why I'm edgy right now. You talk about Big and Pac, Big and Pac. This is a Keith Murray interview. But Big is my man. And he got killed out there like that. And the dude who said they know who killed him, now they saying, okay, the, I have the police know. But they say, yo, but we would have got them guns and we would have popped somebody that night in the name of Big. Word bond. Word to God. I told Big, he asked me, he, he, he said, what do you think I should do? I got some shows in London, in UK. Should I stay here or leave? I said, leave. Come back another time. Because they don't like you out here. And they're very volatile. And guns, they, like, motherfuckers will walk up and shoot people. Literally. Walk up and shoot with AKs and kill people. was killing each other left and right with no problem. You feel me? Like, you asking a question that's real. Like, I'm in a car with Biggie and he asking me this. If it's too soon, I, he asked me, stay or leave? I said, leave, Big. If he would have left, it would have blew over and I felt Biggie Smalls would have been alive to this day. Me personally.